whole grain cereal versus sugar sweetened cereal. Yes, and this is really, I know this is big with the kids. So the kids love to eat all of these sugary, and this is just one in particular, we're not picking on any brand. But anything that's sugar laden versus a more wholesome wheat, and even with the checks, with these for example, this can still have some additives in it and preservatives. And that's true, something I also have learned um, um, being here, the host of the Health Channel, is it doesn't matter if it's Cheerios or Chex exactly. or All Brand. Right. We have to read the labels. Exactly. And it's, it's almost impossible, it's not, but it's almost impossible to find these types of packaged foods that have no preservatives right. at all because then it's not going to last on the shelf. So there has to be sometimes one or two preservatives to be able to meet that shelf life of even a year. So it's so not always those, a bad thing. Exactly. Okay. It's not always a bad thing. And that's why we said, depending on how much you're having of it, if you're having more of your wholesome foods and you have Cheerios sometimes, that's okay, right? So we have to kind of balance that out. Not to say that foods are good or bad because this is something that, you know, I'm a big advocate of this. Food is not good and bad. It's just how okay. much are you having of those maybe high sugar laden sweets right now angie moving on to chips yes and you have singled out my favorite chips <laughs> kettle cooked 40 percent reduced right, fat cake right. pot chips so talk to me about chips versus baked or regular potato chips okay good question and i brought here potatoes like the whole sum where it, where it originally came from so again mm -hmm. this is the less processed obviously when you have a baked potato you can make your own fries and chips at home as well right. i know it's more of an arduous process this is again not any particular brand they're 40 percent reduced fat sometimes you can get them low fat and low salt and those are good too because then they don't have all those added mm -hmm. calories because chips are chips and they are high in fat and many times we don't just sit and eat like one serving we'll eat sometimes half a bag right. or a whole bag some of us and the bags are getting smaller and smaller so it's easier to do that nowadays so we have to just be careful if you're having that try to get a healthier option and again looking at the label in terms of what else are they adding to it there's always going to be some kind of salt as a preservative and for flavor but you could make your own at home so mm -hmm. that's the other thing that many times we we try to kind of enforce that try to make your own types of french fries and the sweet potato fries are delicious they are it's one of my favorite